What's up, everybody? It's Joe from JLW Games coming at you with another cool video back in the Challenge Park, Wind Valley Park, of course. And we're going to continue where we left off immediately from episode 37 here into 38. Now, let's just get straight into it because I know y'all are ready for it uh, for this. So, because nobody knows what this ride is. Totally nobody knows what this ride is. Um,. If you think you know, you are totally wrong. It's uh, definitely false. So, um, whatever you're thinking it is, it's absolutely false. And I can I can absolutely guarantee that you're wrong on whatever your your thoughts. All right, let's see how this goes. We're gonna go ahead and do this. I do want to make sure that I have the banking offset all the way up here. I've never have had such a difficult time trying to figure out a layout for a freaking RMC before. I've never have been this stumped. That's what I was thinking about doing like that speed hill, kind of like Steel Vengeance that has that slight turn on it, ever so slightly, to kind of angle us into a better spot here.
RV. If I can get it set up, we'll see. Is that stopping? There's no need for that to stop there. They'd already cleared the, the break or, or the block. Here, we'll fix this. E I'm going to try and fix this really easily by throwing that there. There we go. I could put on four, but I'm I'm obviously not going to. <laughs> Apparently, there's only 1.1 seconds of airtime on this ride. Apparently, <laughs> some more. I'm not buying it, but. <laughs> Construction update, bros. I thought about doing some walkthroughs with Tony McCoster again, like with uh, this park ev eventually. I get be some fun, be pretty fun. Yeah, look at that rating, greens across the board. I think it's our highest rated coaster at six point sixty three excitement rating. Yeah, just a slightly above Star Rush which has a 4.21 fear rating. This has better fear. Oh, Star Rush just broke down. But this will give the park an amazing one-two punch with our coaster lineup, I think. You have this epic B&M hyper coaster and this freaking hyper hybrid RMC. <clears throat> like what what more could you ask for? I think it's going to be pretty amazing. And it's not quite as long as Steel Vengeance, but it's actually very close within a couple hundred feet of track length of Steel Vengeance, which is pretty significant, I think. It's a pretty nice long ride. We go over here to the results. We will notice that track rating is actually really high, and we're in another autosave. For some reason, we're going to be working on some stuff in the next episode. Uh, so just so you guys know, this is not opening in 2018. I want to keep it realistic because I feel like this wouldn't open in 2018 because of, you know, there's a lot of project RMC projects in that 2018 with big projects such as, you know, Steel Vengeance, Twisted Timbers, and such, you know. So we'll see when this gets open. You know, I'm shooting for 2019.
Guys, there's still a few, a lot of things I still want to do. Anyways, going back to the stats here a little bit. Um, duration of 125.1 seconds, so just over two minutes long. Track length of 5,466 feet, 5,466 uh, 5, feet. Max speed is 77 miles per hour. Per, per hour. <laughs> Average speed of 30 miles an hour, which is huge because I actually think that's one of our challenges here is have a coaster with an average speed of at least 30 miles an hour. So that's cool. And then the G-forces are all fairly normal, except for the vertical G-force is a little high, but, you know. You're telling me there's only one second of air time on this ride. Our entrance and exits here. Entrance. Place our exit. No. No, no, no. <laughs> it wants to immediately go to that. No, you don't. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh my gosh. Why is this so hard? It's making this hard for some reason. All right, we're almost to, uh, we're about to hit the year 2018. Steel Vengeance is about to open in the world, <laughs> if you can believe that. But uh, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe for more amazing content like this. I'm going to catch you guys in the next live stream or video, whichever it may be. And have a great day and an even cooler tomorrow. Thanks so much and goodbye.